Hello everybody and welcome to another video on Jurassic Collectibles. Today we are looking at the Jurassic World Chaos Theory Ben Escape Pack. This comes with Ben as he is first seen in the show alongside a Dilophosaurus and also an Atrociraptor. And you can see for the Chaos Theory branding we have that gorgeous assembly of Darius and the blind Allosaurus, blind in one eye from Big Rock. We have the gorgeous Chaos Theory logo. We have got the kind of almost Camp Cretaceous-esque packaging with the sort of uh, texture work throughout. We have got Jurassic World Chaos Theory, and on the back we've got the Dilophosaurus, we've got Ben, and we've got a Trociraptor Tiger. And I do just want to say a quick shout out to Neems, or the movie poster guy. I believe that he designed this artwork, so it's very cool to have it in hand. And now we are going to crack this open. This is a Target exclusive pack, I believe. Uh, so obviously not available in the UK at present. I did import this. It is unfortunately the kind of glued down packaging where you really have to tear it to get into it. But once we're there, we're in, we can slide these figures out. Okay, and if we just remove the figures from the backdrop, you can see a nice backdrop there of a road, some mountains, and the sunset to one side, which looks really cool. And then the figures themselves in the packaging look really great. I'm really excited to get these out and take a closer look at them. So let's do just that right now. Okay, there we go. Right, let's take a closer look. So here you can see, we have got Ben, the Atrociraptor and the Dilophosaurus all out of the packaging. If I remove these figures, we'll take a look at Ben first. So Ben does come with this uh, tranquilizer rifle. It's the tranquilizer rifle that we see Darius use in the show. We see the DPW use it, so it looks pretty spot on. It is quite big, I think it could have been sized down a little bit, uh, but it is accurate in terms of its aesthetic, so that's cool. And then removing that, this is an outfit that we see Ben wearing in the show. You can see the head sculpt. Looks pretty good for the grown-up Ben, or the hunky guy, as my good friend Brad Jost would call him. Has a really, really nice jacket there. You've got the sort of folded hood at the back. You've got these jeans, and then these boots for Ben as well. So really great addition to the human lineup. Cool to get an adult version of Ben. He has all of the usual articulation we'd expect. And you could probably remove that jacket if you wanted as well. Although there's no point in doing that because an orange version of Ben is coming up in the season two toy wave, uh, as we saw recently. So that is a cool figure of Ben. Very happy to have it. We'll then look at the Atrocity Raptor next. Now the Atrocity Raptors in the show play such an important role, and I believe looking at this that this is Tiger. Uh, which is awesome. This figure looks great. That colour scheme is awesome. I love the fading up the legs. It's a slight shame about the paint error there, but it's okay. Uh, but this looks great. You've got the nice tiger stripes. You've got the great head sculpt we've come to expect. And those forward facing more animated eyes. As well as the jaw just there. This is a fantastic Atrociraptor. I really hope that we do see the Atrociraptors in the Hammond collection eventually, but for now this looks awesome. I really love the sculpt, especially how boxy it makes the head feel, and I just think that this is really what you want for an Atrociraptor. It's so nicely blended. You could have the toe claws painted, but again we don't tend to get them painted in these kinds of sets, so for what it is, it's really nice. You do get the Dino Fax code just there. And I am very happy with this Atrociraptor. And then lastly, we have the Dilophosaurus. Now this does not appear in season one of the show, but it makes sense to include one and it's likely we'll see it in the future. So this appears to be the Jurassic Park version. So we have the black color scheme. We have these gorgeous frills. 
You can see all the paintwork just there, and obviously the removable venom effect just there. And this looks great. This is one of the best Core Wave uh, Dilophosaurus toys that we have seen to date. The paint on this is really crisp, really, really well done. Usual Dilophosaurus mold does have the little dino fax code just there. And that was a figure just diving off a shelf in the background if you heard that. But all in all, really great looking Dilophosaurus. And with the Dilophosaurus looked at, with the Atrociraptor looked at, we'll just get them set up here and we will bring Ben back into shot. That is the Ben Escape Pack. And I have to admit, I like these human packs. I think when you get characters, uh, especially dinosaurs, that look like they could come from the show, it's an even better value proposition, especially if you're somebody who mainly collect, uh, collects even. Could not get that word out. Uh, if you're someone who collects the sort of film accurate stuff, the show accurate stuff, then this is exactly what you want. So really happy with this, really grateful I picked it up. Highly recommend this pack. There are lots of humans from Camp Cretaceous coming out. There will be free versions of Ben available, I believe. Uh, so do choose the one that appeals most to you. With all of that said, guys, I really hope you've enjoyed this review. Make sure to like, favorite and subscribe. And until the next video, take care and have a great Jurassic June.